What's up, my geeks? Jeffrey Powers here from Geekazine, Think Magazine, Put in the Geek, and today we're taking a look at another TubeBuddy fun tutorial. Things that I didn't realize that you have, sometimes have to do and fix and make sure everything works uh, because you want to get that better ranking in YouTube. And this is something that I guess I just didn't realize until somebody has blatantly pointed it out at me. And that's within the SEO score. Now TubeBuddy has this great little feature that allows you to uh, figure out what your SEO score is. And the one thing that I didn't realize that you had to do that actually boosts that SEO score. And that's what we're going to talk about today. So before we do, hey, if you want to go over to buddy.com forward slash geek to buddy.com forward slash geek. And of course, that supports the channel. I appreciate it very much. All right, let's go ahead and get into this. We're going to edit this video. Now, this is a three camera studio. I created this video, uh, I'd say about a year ago, I think it was. And it's basically how to create a uh, uh, three camera studio with the OBS bot or OBSBOT 4K tiny PTZ camera. So let's see, I, I want to I want to increase the SEO on the OBSBOT 4K tiny. Just so you know, uh, TubeBuddy is this little extension that you have that you can put into your YouTube. You download it, it's a Chrome extension, and then it adds special, uh, special links to your YouTube videos where you can do a lot of different things. Like for instance, with this drop down, you can see that I can copy cards, I can copy the end screens, I can publish to Facebook, I can promote with a share tracker, I can set a sunset on my videos if I want to, I can create thumbnails. I've talked about the thumbnails before. You can definitely check out some of those videos. But what we're going to talk about today is SEO Studio. This is a this is a way for you to build up your SEO ranking inside that video. And believe me, this is something you want to check every now and then on some of your videos to make sure that you're in the right direction here. All right, let's go in. And what we're going to do is we're going to we're going to set this up uh, to do OBS bot 4K. We'll just say, well, we'll just say 4K. We'll keep out the tiny part. Uh, so what we're going to do is we're gonna hit start here. Now, what? If, first of all, what it's going to do is it's going to figure out where your target keyword is. And I'm, I'm doing pretty good at 94% on the OBS bot 4K. Notice how the OBS bot 4K is in the title. Notice how it is mentioned a few times in the video, including those uh, chapters. Very important to uh, put those in the chapters. Uh, the one thing I don't have is a hashtag in here. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna add that, OBS bot 4K as a hashtag, and it sees that as a hashtag. On the right side, it gives you a bunch of uh, check boxes to improve the score. So if one of these was red, then I would take a look and I'd say, okay, how do I fix this? But so far I have the saturation of this pretty good. We're at 94%. Let's hit the next button. This is what really blew my mind here. And that is the suggested tags. Now, did you know that if the tag for the item that you want the SEO to really drive in is at the top of the list, that helps your overall SEO? I didn't know that. In fact, if you have YouTube and you have the list of tags, there's no way to sort those tags. This is one of the only few ways that I know of that you can sort these tags and put the item in place. Now, see, I usually have a the default area where it puts in a whole bunch of default tags. And then I put in my extra tags from there. I always put them on the bottom. Now I started putting them on the top for better, better SEO scores. Here, let me show you. So we have the OBSBOT 4K Tiny, that, that one's already there. We're gonna bring that to the top. And we haven't changed too much. It says on the right, it says include the exact target keyword as the first tag and include more relevant ta uh, tags. So we have the OBSBOT Tiny here, but we don't have OBS Bot 4K. Now if I do that, we're still at 94%, but to shoot that up, we're going to uh, make this turn green by moving this all the way to the top. Look at that. Include your exact target keyword right at the top, and now we're at 
of the, the keyword. So uh, let's let's bring in a couple more here. And actually, what I'm going to do is I'm going to go through. There's a couple keywords I'm taking out because they are not really set up for what we're doing here. And we'll bring that in because that's a ranked keyword right there. And uh, we'll do that. So we're at 99%. We, it says to include more relevant keywords. I think I got a few of them here. And I think if I moved one of these up a little bit more, right about there, then, okay, yeah. So I think we're pretty good at 99% is pretty good when it comes to OBSBOT 4K. Uh, OBSBOT Tiny, making sure that a couple different keywords are really in there. And we're gonna hit next. Now we see uh, we see our link here, and, and of course everything that we changed. And uh, here's where it was before. And then of course a little bit of the competition is in this li list right here. So it's suggesting on the thumbnail if you want to, uh, if I wanted to redo the thumbnail, make a nice bright thumbnail with clear text. I'm going to leave this as it is, but I could do something like a A B test on my thumbnails, which is something else that TubeBuddy does offer. We're going to hit next, and then we just simply apply to the video. We could also save this. So if we have other videos that have this exact same plan to it, we can uh, just uh, bring that SEO keyword in and then add all those uh, all those bits and pieces from there. So we'll apply that to the video. It's going to apply. We just hit save and boom. Now we've got everything set up for OBSBOT 4K. Now it doesn't mean that you can't go back and go into SEO and then uh, look for other things. Like for instance, this was about taking three OBS bots, OBSBOT 4K tinies, and making a small little studio, switching back and forth between cameras. So I used Telestream Wirecast for that. I used the OBSBOT and I used a small studio. So these are three SEO areas that I can really explore. So I can go back into the SEO Tag Explorer and do a search for uh, Wirecast, do a search for uh, uh, Three Camera Studio and get those to the top as close to the top of the list as possible. So we might be hitting 99% on OBSBOT 4K. We could hit about 90% when it comes to Telestream Wirecast or 95. We could hit about 95% when it comes to Three Camera Studio. Three different plans of attack on the same uh, same system here. So that is what the SEO studio will help us do is rank our videos better by creating S the SEO keywords to there. So pretty interesting stuff. And the one thing, like I said, I did not know for the life of me, I did not know. Look at this. If you go down to the tags, down here on the tags, th there's no way you can't you can't move these around. The only thing that I can do and this, I can copy them all and I can delete them and then I can put the tags that I want in and then I can repaste the tags and then go from there. So I love this tag area. Of course, the recommended tags, finding out the keyword scores on some of these tags, uh, putting in different extra keywords, saving that to help in different types of SEO uh, instances. It's just amazing. And of course, let's take a look at the page now. So I loaded up the YouTube video and look at that SEO score right there. It, where it was at something like 90% before, now we've got an SEO score of 99% for our targeted keywords of OBSBOT 4K. Pretty cool stuff from uh, from TubeBuddy. A great add-on for your YouTube. If you YouTube, you definitely want to use this program. Of course, if you go to uh, TubeBuddy.com forward slash geek, TubeBuddy.com forward slash geek, use that code word geek. And of course, that helps me keep the lights on and gets more tutorials and more product stuff to you. That's it for today. Jeffrey Powers here from Geekazine Think Magazine, put in a geek. Go ahead, like, subscribe, comment, Comment, hit that bell notification so you know when the next video comes out and then let me know in the comments if you're using TubeBuddy and how you use TubeBuddy. Is there any aha moment that I might need from here like the tags and let me know and let's geek out together. Take care and geek out.